As many as 30 members are working to form a new group within caucus. Among Ontario Conservative MP Marilyn Gladu is leading that effort. She is in Hamilton, Ontario. Ms. Gladu, thank you very much for speaking with us today. I'm wondering if you can start by explaining what is the Civil Liberties Caucus and what does it stand for? Well, Katie, thanks for having me. Uh, basically, when we went back to Ottawa to meet as a caucus, um, a number of the MPs were talking about issues we had heard from our constituents. And uh, we thought, well, you know, let's get together and talk more about this. And then more MPs and senators heard and said, yeah, you know, we're hearing these things as well. We'd like to, to, to get along and join. And so really, it's early days yet, but there are a number of issues that have arisen um, based on, you know, the vaccines and vaccine mandates that have come into place. And people are losing their jobs across the country without reasonable accommodation in some cases. And, you know, citizens are concerned. So um, this working group uh, will uh, talk to medical experts, legal experts, ask the questions that Canadians are asking and bring back uh, recommendations for our policy consideration at, at national caucus. So a civil liberties caucus is taking shape on Parliament Hill, spearheaded by Conservative MP and former party health critic Marilyn Gladu, with the mission of defending anti-vaxxers who face suspensions and terminations at work. The group is separate from the Conservatives' official opposition caucus, but will reportedly be made up of Conservative MPs and Senators. Will they get party backing and who exactly will they be fighting for? And how about leader Aaron O'Toole? Is this new caucus a direct challenge to him? Let's find out. And joining me now is Conservative MP-elect Marilyn Gladu, a former party leadership candidate and a member of the Civil Liberties Caucus movement. Hi, Ms. Gladu. Thank you for being there. Um, Great to be here. First, I, I, I have to ask you this. Are you vaccinated against COVID-19? And, and is this about you? Uh, no, this is absolutely not about me. Uh, as you may be aware, I haven't disclosed my vaccination status publicly um, because I'm trying to uh, stand on the principle of medical privacy. Uh, this is an important thing for many in this country, and we want to make sure that uh, that right is protected. So you feel that the question asking people if they're vaccinated is an infringement on their civil liberties, but you're asked that question if you walk into a restaurant, a cafe, a gym, a hairdresser. So are, are civil liberties being infringed all day long, all the time now? That is a great question for the Civil, civil Liberties Caucus. This is the kind of work that this uh, working group will do. We will bring in you know, legal experts, uh, those that are stakeholders, and, and get the answers to these questions that people are asking. So who is in this caucus? How many of you? Is it only you know, conservative MPs and senators? Well, it's early days yet because we've only had a couple of meetings. Originally, um, when we returned to Ottawa, a bunch of MPs were talking about the issues that we were hearing.